Hello, my name is Etienne Fontaine. Thank you for joining. I'm a SRE at Blablacar. And in today's talk, I'm, I'm going to talk about Istio Redirector, a tool that we have created and open sourced to let our SEO manager handle all of our HTTP redirection on our public website. So why do we need redirection? We used to have a monolith handling all the pages with a bus destination on all the cities that we have on many countries generating thousands of pages on a website. But since a few years, we are migrating to a SOA uh, um, architecture uh, where the new pages now have the path with a dash one or dash three or a number in the URL. So the path is different and the old page does not exist anymore. That implies that people having bookmarked or the old page or the SEO bus will face a 404 page and that's not great for our business. So we need to redirect all those pages to the new one. This is made available through HTTP with 300 redirection or 400 for example. The result will be happy user as they won't face 404 pages anymore. Happy Google bot or any SEO bot as they won't face 400 pages and the happy SEO specialist because all the work done before on your old pages will be transferred to the new one and uh, the website uh, will be ranked uh, higher on the, SEO, on the search engine. In your example, how do we use Istio? We are deployed on GKE on Google Cloud. We use the Google Cloud load balancer globally and we have the Istio gateway and then our web application. So when the, uh, the user makes a request to our domain, it will reach the Google Cloud Load Balancer and then our Istio gateways. And this is where the magic happens. We have deployed custom resource named Virtual Service made available through the custom resource definition of Istio, which allow you by matching a host and the URI, URI sorry, to redirect the page to a new one with a given static host code. But virtual services are very complex to maintain and to, to create, especially if you have many domains and uh, many pages. So to do that, we have and the ease to the, the work of our SEO specialists, which are used to work with CSV file. We have created a UI and the backend services that will take the CSV file and convert it to a virtual services at the uh, made available on the YAML file that you can uh, directly push uh, to your GitOps uh, repository. So the backend is a Golang service that can convert the CSV file to a virtual service, create a pull request on GitHub on your GitOps repository, but also fetch information from the Kubernetes cluster where the Istio Redirector is deployed, so you can show on the UI all the virtual services and the redirection that are already deployed. Also, it exposes an API that can be used on the CLI or with a web UI made with React.js. So the SEO specialist will use, obviously, the web application, which is really easy to use. So how does it work? Your SEO specialist will have a CSV file with all the current URL and the new one and a specific status code. So for example, 301 for permanent redirection, but it can be any 300 redirection or even 400 redirection. Once the CSV is saved, it can be imported on the UI. It, the application will take care of parsing the file and showing all the redirection that has been detected. The SEO specialist will specify the env environment where the uh, redirection will be deployed pre-production, staging, production, a namespace, and eventually the group name that will be used to name the virtual service. Then, by a single click on a button, the payload will be sent to the backend where the virtual service will be generated as a YAML file and either sent back to the user if they do not use GitHub or sent to GitHub and create a new pull request 
on your GitHub's repository on the given environment. Then, your developer will be asked for a review, as usual on your GitHub's repository, and on a single click, merge the pull request, and it will be deployed and made available in production in a few minutes. Today at Blablacar, we have more than 26,000 redirections running in production without any impact on performance. So as you may think, pushing so many redirections and, and configuration on your mesh can impact each Istio proxy and your control plane. But we have leveraged the use of Istio sidecars to limit the impact of the virtual services and only deploy the redirection on the namespace that handle the gateways. The project is now available on GitHub on the Blablacar uh, organization. Feel free to open issue, create pull request and comment if you need. And you can obviously use Istio Rejector on your own organization uh, by deploying the M chart that is uh, also available on the GitHub repository. And if you have any question, feel free to reach to me, either on Twitter or LinkedIn. Thank you for joining, and uh, do not hesitate for if you have any questions.